In this demonstration, I'll show you how to solve a linear algebraic bank interest type problem with two unknowns. The question reads, Ramona has a total of $5,000 to invest. She puts part of it in an account paying 5% per year interest and the rest in a GIC paying 7.2% interest. If she has 349 in simple interest at the end of the year, how much was invested at each rate? So we're assuming that she made $349 by investing part of her money in a 5% account and part of her money in a 7.2% account. So we know that her, okay, so let's label A and B as the money she placed in the 5% account and B as the money she placed in the 7.2% account and we know that she invested five thousand dollars so we know that a plus B is equal to five grand so that's one of the formulas we're going to use the second formula we're going to create is one that relates the percentages and of course the money that she made at the end so we know that a times 5% and we're not going to use 5% we're going to use the decimal version of 5% so we divide it by 100 0 0.05 plus B times the percentage of the second account which is 0 0.072 is equal to a total of $349 that she made that being said we now have a linear system with two a linear system with two unknowns. There are several ways you can answer this and the two ways that I have shown in previous videos is the addition subtraction method or the substitution method. Each of those will work in a situation like this. Before we begin this process of solving for A and B, let's simplify the second equation. And the way we can simplify it is simply by removing these brackets since they're not necessary. 0.05a plus 0.072b is equal to 349. Now we have to choose which of these two letters you want to eliminate, whether it's A or B. And it really doesn't matter which one you choose, so let's choose A. Now since we want to eliminate a, we have to make the coefficient in front of this A the same as that. So let's multiply this whole equation by 0 0.05. And if we do that, we end up with the following. 0.05A plus 0.05B is equal to 5,000 times 0 0.05, and that gives us 250. So we're focusing on this and this, and just to make it clear, I'm going to erase everything you see here and everything you see here. So we have these two equations to work with, and we're going to subtract them, because by subtracting them, it will ensure that the a's are gone. So if we subtract them, we get 0. This number subtracted by this number is equal to... an answer of negative 0 0.022 is equal to this number subtracted by that number and it looks like the answer is negative 99. Now just to double check 250 minus 349 is equal to negative 99. That being said we can now solve for B by dividing both sides by negative 0 0.022 and our answer for B is equal to 4500. Now if you recall that first formula that we created was A plus B is equal to 5000. So to solve for A we have to rearrange where we have 5000 minus 4,500 4, is equal to 500. Therefore, we can conclude that Ramona 
invested 500 dollars into A and 4,500 into B. If you found this tutorial helpful, please support our channel by subscribing or by liking this video. If you have any further questions, you may visit our website at biology-forums.com. We are an online service for students seeking free homework help. See you soon.